Welcome to the Bremen Drop Tower, where we carry out experiments under microgravity conditions. By creating a vacuum inside the drop tube, we are able to achieve a microgravity quality of one millionth of Earth gravity. But this takes a preparation time of 100 minutes before every drop. However, there are many experiments which require a much higher repetition rate than we can offer today. Well, this is our solution. Let me introduce you to the brand new microgravity facility we are working on right now, the Gravitower Bremen prototype. This new facility achieves a similarly high microgravity quality as the existing Bremen drop tower, but without a vacuum. To achieve this, the air resistance is not eliminated, but compensated by a slider that encloses the experiment during free fall. The experiment and the slider are accelerated from the bottom of the tower as in the existing catapult of the Bremen drop tower. This is done by a rope drive with a very low initial acceleration in order to minimize structural vibrations. This reduces the vibrations transmitted to the experiment even more. The slider acts as a shield from the air drag, like a contact-free vehicle brought to the exact same speed as the experiment during free fall. Inside the slider, there is no relative velocity between air and experiment. Towards the end of the free fall, the experiment is recoupled to the slider and both are decelerated by the rope drive. The advantages of the new system are obvious. With the GTB Pro, scientists can carry out hundreds of experiments every day with a microgravity duration of two and a half seconds. They can bring their experiments here and operate the whole system using this user-friendly control station. All safety functions are fully automated to allow users to focus only on their experiments. This means, compared to similar microgravity facilities worldwide, ZAM can offer the longest microgravity duration in the Droptower Bremen, as well as the highest repetition rate for individual experiment setups in the GTB Pro.